I am an artist, I guess I would say. You know, I did want to dabble in different things. So I used the pens and grabbed some yarn and just dibbled and dabbled. And ever since, I couldn't stop. I'm addicted. You know, I can't creatively, you know, come up with something by sketching and looking at it that way. I kind of just have to do it. It comes out better while I'm doing it versus, you know, premeditated. I'm kind of thinking now if this was a good idea with these colors, but I think I'm gonna make it work and see what happens. My inspiration was roses. You know, if you can maybe get that from like the darker green and the red I used and try to throw a little pink in there just to, you know, brighten it up a bit. But, you know, I did a, a bumblebee, which is over there and a little monster, but I'm really big on the abstract. You know, I just do it. I just do it and I like it. And then, you know, that's all it is really. Usually with my more random ones, I just pin them and just go along as I, you know. And if I don't like it, take it down, do it over again. I have blisters now, you know, trying to push the pins into the wood because I don't want to hammer I'm in an apartment complex. Even sometimes with the yarn, I have to wear gloves now, but sometimes with the yarn and the abstracty ones, I get, you know, little burns from the yarns. And it's, it's my arms hurting on the big ones and it's crazy, yeah. I take breaks. You know, I guess it pains for things to come out nice looking, I guess. I'm gonna make them purple. Well, right now I'm using um, push pins, you know, thumbtacks. I have used nails before. You know, I've just started with these um, wood palettes. I'm in the beginning stages, so I'm, you know, trying to perfect it in a way where People won't get hurt if they want to take it home. Sometimes I'll take out a push pin, you know, add a push pin, take down, sometimes I'll just take the whole thing down. Once I'm finished, I'm like, mm, I don't really like it. Look at it from different angles. I'll just take it all down and start all over, so. I just like to see the outcome. Like, I'm really excited to see what the outcome's gonna turn out. You know, something about the texture really brings out the color and you can really see it a lot better with, you know, maybe a thicker yarn versus a thinner one or... That's why I try to use the thinner lines, you know, with the thicker ones to kind of give it some type of dimension. People have seemed to like them. People have really seemed to like them. I haven't gotten any requests yet, but people have seemed to like them. You know, I'm kind of um, excited about it. See where this takes me. <laughs>